We got the Seattle Storm versus the Chicago Sky. Angel Reese battled Neko Gumake all game, started out getting an offensive rebound and finishing right over her. And then on his next play, watch her go to work on six foot six Mercedes Russell. Thought she couldn't play against Biggs. Then we got Angel Reese finishing on the break from Marina Mabry. Then here you go, Mo Angel Reese versus Neko Ogumake. And that's Coach Shell Reed for the Minnesota Lynx who said, Neko is the biggest flopper in WNBA history. Ayo, hey, in this game, Angel shot four of nine from the field, got her first double-double, had three assists, and we about to show you those assists, and then we gonna get to the rebounds and defense. But watch Angel Reese set up Dana Evans' Draymond Green style. Nice little handoff, set the pick to give her the space she needed. Then watch the nice inbound pass from Diamond to Shields. Angel Reese surveying, surveying, Marina Mabry, dead eye. Then watch on this next one, you're going to see Angel Reese miss from point blank range. But the good thing is, it counts for two offensive rebounds. And right before she get pushed out of bounds, she found Kennedy Carter for another assist. Then on his next play, Angel Reese matched up against Ezzy Magbagor, jumped on the pass, and ended up with a tie-up. And shout out Ezzy Magbagor, she had a great game. Five blocks was sending they shit everywhere. But even with all that jumping, you couldn't win the jump ball. Then watch Mercedes Russell try the big girl Euro step. Angel Reese says no, and I'll take that. So far early in the season, to me, Angel Reese has been the best rookie. She's been showing up as a leader on both ends of the floor. It's just been really fun to see. Angel Reese is also the only rookie to be leading the WNBA in a statistical category. Which one, you might ask? Offensive rebounding. Same thing she did at LSU. But very quickly, my final thought on this game. Both teams look really good. Chicago is definitely lacking in offense. Outside of that, their defense is amazing. On the other side for Seattle, their chemistry is just starting to form. Everybody taking shots and passing the ball. Nobody's being selfish. But I also want to say this, Skylar Diggins, please stop calling for a review after every damn foul. Some of these calls going to go against you, girl. You can't get a review every time. You got Noel Quinn over there sitting on pins and needles. But other than that, that's all I got for you guys. Let me know your thoughts on the game and on both teams. I'm Elsa Chu for PR&M. Talk to you on the next one.